Hello everyone, welcome to another question and answer session. A 63 years old man is reviewed in the vascular clinic as he is noted to have a pulsatile swelling between the greater trochanter and pubic tubercle. Which vessel is most likely to be affected? So from this question, uh, we know that the pulsatile swelling and this pulsatile swelling is located between the greater trochanter and pubic tubercle so we have to find out one of the vessel which is located between the greater tubercle of the femur and the pubic tubercle here are the options the options are internal iliac artery inferior epigastric artery common iliac artery external iliac artery and femoral artery so we have to find out one of the artery which is located between the greater tubercle greater trochanter and pubic tubercle so let's see in the picture in this picture we can see this is the greater tubercle here this is the greater tubercle and here the pubic tubercle and pubic crest so we can see between the greater tubercle uh, greater trochanter and pubic tubercle there is artery and this artery is the femoral artery so the femoral artery it is located between the greater trochanter and pubic tubercle so this should be the answer and we can see this some other landmarks here just as there is the atrus iliac spine here the head of the femur here we can see the erector tubercle and epicoicial line but here most important that this is this artery and this artery is the femoral artery and this femoral artery is located between the greater trochanter and pubic tubercle and we can see some other picture in this picture we can see first of all we can landmark uh the greater tubercle is located somewhat like this and the pubic tubercle here so between these two vessel present only the femoral artery and femoral vein so these points here this is the femoral artery and femoral vein so the structure will be here only the femoral vein not other we can see some other structures such as here this is the common iliac vein on both sides and from the common iliac artery common iliac vein the common iliac artery and from the common iliac artery this one is the external iliac artery and here this is the internal iliac artery so the external internal uh, iliac artery and internal iliac artery they located more above from this line so the vessel located in this area and we can see the external iliac artery common iliac artery and the external or uh, internal iliac artery they are located more above from this line so they are not located at this place in this picture we can see this is the inferior epigastric artery and our landmark is between the greater trochanter and pubic tubercle that means from this line but we can see the inferior epigastric artery this artery the inferior artery it arises more above from this line so our final answer is the femoral artery the femoral artery it uh, is located between the greater trochanter of the femur and the pubic tubercle and as this is artery so there is the swelling should be pulsatile so pulsatile swelling located between the greater trochanter and pubic tubercle this artery is the femoral artery so answer is the femoral artery thank you all